our next problem question number 23 is log a to the base b into log b to the base c into log c to the base a whole cube is equal to what we have to find the value of this options are 3 0 1 and none of these now when we see the first term it is log a to the base b now with base change formula we know that it can be written as log a upon log b. This can be written as log a any base upon log b any base. So first term can be written like this. Similarly other two terms can also be written. So we are having now that log of a upon b is log a upon log b into second term in the similar fashion can be written log b upon log c and third term can be written log c upon log a whole cube our expression reduces to this now log a and log a can be cancelled log b and this log b can be cancelled and log c and log c are cancelled. So inside bracket we obtain 1. 1 to the power 3 which is 1. Hence the answer is c. The value of this expression is 1. Question number 24 is that log of 64 to the base 2 root 2 is. Options are 2 root 2, 1 by 2, none of these. Now we have to find here log 64 to the base 2 root 2. Now, we suppose that this value is x. Now, with the definition of log, we can write this as 2 root 2 to the power x is equal to 64. Because from the definition of log, we know that if log of m to the base a is x, then that implies a raised to the power x is equal to m. This is the definition of log and with this definition we can write 2 root 2 to the power x is equal to 64. Now root 2 we know that root 2 can be written as 2 to the power 1 by 2. So inside bracket I can write 2 to the power 1 into 2 to the power 1 upon 2. This raised to the power x is equal to 64 and 64 can be written as 2 raised to the power 6. Now, bracket when we solve 1 and 1 by 2 will be added. So, it will be 3 upon 2 and the power will become on left hand side 2 raised to the power 3 upon 2 into x. 1 plus 1 upon 2 will be 3 upon 2. It will be multiplied by x. Right hand side we have 2 raised to the power 6. Now both the sides base is same, base is 2. So powers will also be same. So 3 upon 2x is equal to 6. 3 will cancel this 6 as from 2 times. Therefore x is equal to 4. Hence the value of x is equal to 4. That is the value of log 64 to the base 2 root 2 is 4. Now which option is 4? None of these. Our option D is correct. None of these. Now we will see question number 25. The value of log 25 to the base 8 is when it is given that log 2 is equal to 0 0.3010 and these are the options given. Now, here we are to find log 25 to the base 8. Now, we know that log 25 to the base 8 can be written as log 25 upon log 8. This can be written like this to any base. Now, to any base means we can take base as 10. So, I have written log 25 to the base 10 upon log 8 to the base 10. Now 25, log 25 to the base 10 
we do not know the value because it is not given in the question. We have been given in the question that value of log 2 is 0 0.3010. So what we do, we write 25 as 100 upon 4. So we can write log 25 as log 100 upon 4 to the base 10. 25 can be written as 100 upon 4 and denominator what we do 8 can be written as 2 to the power 3. So in denominator we have log 2 to the power 3 to the base 10. Now log m upon n formula can be used in numerator. So that gives us log 10 to the power 2 minus log 4 upon log 2 to the power 3 to the base 10. 100 can be written as 10 to the power 2 and I have used the formula log m upon n to the base a is log m minus log n base is 10. Base everywhere is 10. Now 2 will come ahead. 2 will be multiplying log 10 to the base 10 and log 10 to the base 10 is 1. So first term will have the value 2. So first term is 2. Second is log 4 can be written as 2 to the power 2. So it will be 2 log 2 to the base 10 upon denominator is log 2 to the power 3 base 10. So it can be written log 3 log 2 to the base 10. Now I have reduced the given expression in the form log 2 and log 2 value is known 0 0.3010 that I put. So I am now getting 2 minus 2 into log 2 is 0 0.3010 3010 upon 3 into log 2 which is 0 0.3010 and now I am to simplify it. Simplification will give me 2 minus 2 into 0 0.3010 is 0 0.6020 upon 3 into 30 0.3010 is 0 0.9030. This comes out to be 1.398 upon 0 0.9030. Divide it. This comes out to be 1.5 481. So, with this, our option C is correct. 